In this video, we'll unveil the top 10 highest earning African players at the AFCON 2024. Our countdown begins with the Senegalese short stopper Edward Mendy. At 31, this touring goalie stands tall at 197cm and his earnings are not short of impressive. On the field, he pockets a cool $12 million. While off the field, he's not doing too shabby with another $1 million. Mendy's journey is like a football fairy tale. Born in France to his Senegalese father and a French mother, Mendy faced early career hurdles. But hey, he's not one to back down. After conquering lower French leagues, he caught Chelsea's eye and the rest isn't just history, it's a legend. After an unforgettable Champions League triumph at Chelsea in 2021, Mendy was awarded both the UEFA goalkeeper of the year and the best FIFA goalkeeper of the same year, becoming the first African goalkeeper in football's history to win both awards. Fast forward to 2023, Mendy finds himself at Al Hali after making waves at Chelsea, securing the bag and continuing to be a rock in the goalpost. Now let's talk about the man who overcame more than just defenders on the pitch, the cool bird as he's fondly called Sebastian Holler. At 29, this Ivory Coast striker has faced his first choice of challenges, including a battle with testicular cancer in 2022. But guess what? He kicked cancer on the head and made a remarkable return in 2023. Off the pitch, Hola isn't your typical flashy footballer. He enjoys popping wines and spending quality time on vacations. Everyone needs a break, right? In July 2022, Hola signed a lucrative deal with Borussia Dortmund worth 31 million euros, possibly rising to 34.5 million with bonuses. However, just 12 days after signing, he withdrew from the team's preseason training camp after being diagnosed with a malignant testicular tumor. He underwent surgeries and chemotherapy to combat the disease and finally returned to full-time training in January 2023. Hola played his first match in almost 8 months in a friendly against Fortuna Dusseldorf and scored a hat-trick in a 6-0 victory against Basel. Our list wouldn't be complete without talking about Ivorian sought-after midfielder Seko Fufana, the midfield maestro making a mark in Saudi Arabia. At 28, this Ivorian sensation decided to switch from Liguan to the Saudi Pro League. He left ROC Lens and joined Al Nassar, bagging a sweet deal with on-field earnings of $16 million and a bid from off-field ventures. Despite his impressive net worth, Fofana keeps his private life under wraps. We don't know about his ride or his mansion, but we do know he's committed to Al Nassar until 2026, earning a weekly wage of €34,615. Thomas Party represents the prize of Ghana on this prestigious list. Renowned for his versatility, strong defensive abilities, and precise passing, Thomas stand as one of the Premier League's best defensive midfielders. At 30 years old, he not only commands a significant on-field earning of $13 million, but also adds an impressive $3 million off the field. Pate is not just a key player for Arsenal, he is also the third most followed Ghanaian footballer on social media. Beyond his contribution on the field, Pate has become one of the most influential Ghana athletes globally. His endorsements and sponsorship deals with brands like Adidas reflect his impact and marketability in the sports world. Born on June 13, 1993, in Odumase, Krober, Ghana, to a humble family, Thomas' journey to success is a testament of his determination and talent. Raised by a local football coach father and a petty trader mother, Thomas, along with his brother Francis, became the mainstay of their father's local team. The family's love of football instilled by their father for the party brother's ambition to turn their passion into a means to lift their family out of poverty. Thomas embarked on his journey to Europe, leaving behind his family without their knowledge knowledge, seeking to succeed in football to provide for his loved ones. The path to Europe wasn't easy, it evolved trails in Spain, where Thomas impressed at Atletico Madrid before moving up to the B team. Diego Simeone recognized his talent and Thomas even trained with the first team occasionally. It took seven months before his family realized he was not in Ghana. Thomas' father supported his decision, having already sacrificed significantly for his son's football dream. Before we go on, it's time to do us a little favor by hitting that subscribe button. <laughs> I promise you, those bots in Dunbar. Moving on, powerhouse midfielder from the Ivory Coast, Frank Kessier, secures the sixth spot on the list with earning totaling $17 million. At 28 years old, Kessie boots an on-field income of $15 million, coupled with an additional $2 million off the field. His versatility, physical presence, and goal-scoring prowess has earned him a significant reputation in the football world. Having recently played for Barcelona and contributed to their La Liga EA Sport title, Kessie made a lucrative move 
move to Saudi Pro League club Al Ahi and does with endorsement deals, including one with Adidas. Casey's off-fit ventures complement his prowess on the pitch. Born into a middle-class family, Frank had the privilege to pursue his passion for soccer. Contrary to misinformation, he wasn't a last comer to the sport, spending his early years playing on local selections clay pitches, including Zadi FC. Ashraf Hakimi, the energetic Moroccan star, claims the fifth spot as one of the highest earning African footballers, amazing a total income of $20 million. At the age 24, Akimi's on-feed earning reached $15 million while his off-feed ventures contributes an additional $5 million. Known for his exceptional pace and versatility, Akimi has played for prestigious clubs like Real Madrid, Borussia Dortmund and Inter Milan, making him one of the most sought-after talents in the football world. Behind his on-field prowess, Akimi's marketability is evident through sponsorship deals with Adidas UK and endorsements from major brands such as Nike, Pepsi and Hawaii. With a significant social media presence, he is recognized as one of the most marketable African athletes globally. Akimi's personal life has also been under the spotlight, notably due to his divorce with Spanish actress Hiba Abu. Despite Despite his challenges, Akimi with a reported net worth of $24 million manages his finances wisely, which he spares his salary with 80% going to his mother's account, places him as the 6th highest paid athlete in Africa, earning around $215,000 per week. Chief Security Officer Kalude Kolibali claims the 4th spot on our list with total earnings amounting to $26 million. At 32 years old, Kolibali is recognized for his exceptional strength, speed and energetic game reading ability. He has solidified his position as one of the best African defenders globally, previously representing Serie A club Napoli for over 7 years before making a notable switch to Chelsea in 2022. Despite his brief stings with Chelsea, Kolibali has made a life-changing decision to join Al Hilal in the 2023 summer transfer window, securing an annual income of approximately $26 million. In his candid admission, Kolibali stated, I can't deny it, I'm going to Arabia for the money. I'll be able to help my whole family to live well from my parents to my cousins. Off the pitch, Kolibali maintains a strong presence as one of the most followed Senegalese footballers on social media, adding another dimension to his impact beyond the playing field. Brian Mares, a key figure in Man City's recent successes, secured the third position on our list as one of the highest paid African footballers. At 32 years old, the Algerian keeper transitioned to Al Alhi in the Saudi Pro League, experiencing a significant boost to his annual salary estimated at $30 million. Beyond his own field contributions, Mares engages in lucrative off-field ventures, including deals with Nike and Pepsi. Mares' journey from the poverty-stricken suburbs of Paris to becoming a football sensation reflects his resilience and, and determination. His success stories is intertwined with the challenges faced by his family during the 2005 riots in Sarsilis, creating a backdrop for his rise in the football world. The tragic death of Mares' father, at the age of 15, served as a catalyst for his commitment to the sport, propelling him to success. From initially mistaking Leicester City for a rugby team, Maris became a legend for the club, winning the Premier League title and earning individual accolades. Sadio Mane, the former Liverpool star, claims the second spot as one of the highest paid African footballers, accumulating a staggering income of $52 million. At 31 years old, the Senegalese forward, known for his blazing speed and impeccable ball control, transitioned to Al Nassar in the South the Pro League. His on-field earnings of $48 million annually, coupled with $4 million from off-field ventures, making not only the highest paid African footballer in history, was also one of the top earners globally in 2023. Mane's illustrious career includes achievements with Liverpool, where he played a pivotal role in their successes, contributing to their Champions League title in 2019 and Premier League success in 2020. Off the pitch, Mane has secured lucrative deals with major brands, including New Balance, Defying his status as a football icon both on and off the field. Mohamed Salah secures the top spot as the highest paid African footballer in 2023. At 31 years old, Salah has consistently been a top scorer in the English Premier League, solidifying his status.
tattoos as an all-time great for Liverpool. His on-field earnings start at an impressive 35 million annually, while his off-field ventures contribute an additional 18 million to his total income. Salah's impact on the field is evidenced in his goal-scoring prowess, contributing significantly to Liverpool's success, including leading them to win the 2019 UEFA Champions League. Off the pitch, Salah extends his influence with signature deals, including boots with Adidas and partnership with brands such as Pepsi and Vodafone. His journey from Basel to Chelsea, Florentina, Roma, and finally Liverpool showcases his remarkable career trajectory. Marked by individual accolades such as the Premier League Golden Boot for the 2017-2018 season, as Salah continues to make history and chase new milestones, his title as the highest-paid African footballer solidifies his position as a global football icon. So if you enjoyed the video, kindly click on the subscribe button and like, and click on the end screen on your left to watch the richest player in Nigeria.